Oh, hello, ma'am. What can I do to help you? Uh, it, I'm looking for my daughter. I, I heard that she fainted in school during lunch, and, well, apparently she's here. Um, I need to see her, please. Okay, can I please ask for a name? Aislinn Marie Winters. That's her name. Aislinn Marie Winters. Okay, I'll just search her right up on my computer, and we'll find her for you, alright? Alright. Thank you so much. Here we are, Aislinn Marie Winters, room 504, level 2. Thank you, again. I'll be back. Goodbye! I hope your daughter's alright! Hello? Oh, my dog. I'm so sorry to interrupt. I just... I came to see my daughter. This is her room, and... I just came here, and... Uh, I'm sorry. Oh, it's quite alright. I know you're worried about your daughter. Yes, Aislinn, she's fine. But she just had a little... I guess, knockout. Quite strange. Nothing seems to be wrong with her. All I heard was that she fainted in school during lunch. And I came as quick as I could. But how can she be alright? There has to be some cause of, well, her passing out. I want to know the reason as much as you, ma'am. But I've tried so many different things, and I just can't seem to find the answer. I'm sure you'll find something eventually. Is it alright if I stay here and sit with her for a bit? Oh, yes, that's fine. And I'm Dr. Carey, Aislinn's doctor, of course. You must be Mrs. Winters, obviously. I'm Katrine Winters. Yes, Aislinn's mother. It's nice to meet you, Dr. Carey. Thank you for taking care of my daughter. Well, it is my job. You can take a seat right by that bench over there. Okay, thank you. Oh, Aislinn. Please, get better. Mom? Where am I? You were in the hospital, dear. Do you feel okay? I feel fine. What happened? One thing, I was in school, and next thing, I'm in the hospital? You fainted at school, sweetie. So, now you're here at the hospital. I'm Dr. Carey. You're a doctor. I fainted? I don't remember that. Actually, I don't remember much before that either. Huh. I remember I was in lunch, and I had two people with me, a girl and a guy, and I think we had become friends. And I don't really remember anything else. Hmm. Well, yes, you passed out, sweetie, so now you're in the hospital. They took you to the nurse first, and that's when they called me, but they called me after I got there, saying that they had brought you here because they thought it would be more serious than just fainting. You looked kind of different than just fainting. Different? What do you mean by that? Well, apparently you fainted, but you fainted with your eyes open. So, they thought it looked kind of unusual, so that's why they wanted to get professional help. But even our team of doctors couldn't figure out why you had your eyes open. It's quite strange, you know? This is all really strange. Can I just go to sleep or something? You need to take some medicine tablets first, and then you can sleep. Fine. Oh, they're not that bad, really. They're pretty easy to take, too. Let's just get it over with, okay? Alright. These are the tablets. Okay.
you actually only need to take one pill. Here you go. Does it taste alright? It tasted fine. Thanks. Can I please go to sleep now? Yes, you may have a full rest. Please, sleep all you want. It'll help you get better. Thank goodness. Ugh. Oh my.